This is Winnipeg's Ingressors Group Field, where the Ottawa Red Blacks played their first CFL regular season game ever in July 2014. It's November 2015 now, the 28th to be precise, and it's the day before the biggest game the Red Blacks have played ever, the Great Cup game against the Edmonton Eskimos. Can they win the franchise's first CFL championship? Well, we'll have to find out. There's no doubt, though, that just getting here has been something of a Cinderella story for the Red Blacks. The question is, do they end up in the, with a pumpkin or do they end up in a carriage? Henry, there's been a lot of hoopla this week. You, you know, the awards ceremony and all of the media coverage. How do you get your teammates to um, focus on the assignments tomorrow? Well, uh, number one, uh, when I've talked about the hunger that's in our locker room, um, that hunger still exists, trust me. Um, you know, we've been able to put everything from the past that's happened uh, behind us uh, throughout this entire season, whether it was good or bad. And we told, we told the guys that, you know, pretty much what happens in the Grey Cup uh, is a celebration of, of, of this game, the CFL, this great country we're playing in, but also the two teams that were able to make it through the juggernaut of season that, that we played through each and every year. And this is a celebration of our accomplishment as well. And of course, just like Coach Campbell said, enjoy it, but up to a point. You know, we know because at some point, we got to get ready for this big game because that's the sole reason why we came here. And our guys have been talking about that continuously throughout this week, regardless of you know how much enjoyment they've you know uh, uh, been able to to experience here in Winnipeg. Uh, the bottom line is our focus is strictly on business and, and playing this game tomorrow, and that's all we've been looking forward to. Two, three, thank you. Are